Hello everyone, hope you all are doing great. Today is the second episode of the series College Guide and in this episode we are going to talk about IIT Kharagpur and I'm so excited while shooting this video because I am also a pass out of IIT Kharagpur. First let me introduce myself. I am Parul Sharma. I am an architect and I did my masters from IIT Kharagpur in infrastructure design and management. First of all let's discuss about bachelors of architecture. IIT Kharagpur is one of the three IITs that provide BR. Okay. The process to enter into the bachelor's course of IIT Kharagpur is uh, you have to appear into JE mains paper one and after that those students who clear uh, JE advance they need to give another exam that is architecture aptitude test. So if you are clearing all this series then you will be able to enter into B arc of IIT Kharagpur or any other IITs. The next and most important thing about this department and about this course is it was established in 1952. It's as old as that. So here the course B arc is a five year course as uh, anywhere it is and it will be a semester system course. There will be total of 10 semesters in B arc. I have personally visited the department of architecture in IIT Kharagpur and it's amazing. It's seriously amazing. It gives you that feel of architecture department and professors over there are highly creative and innovative and you know you get the feel of uh, being into architecture department and being into that complete decorum of it and yeah it's really amazing and I will attach the link to the course curriculum in the description below. So the next course that we are going to talk about is Masters in City Planning that Department of Architecture offers. Okay, now in this course, the way to enter into this course is through GATE. This post graduation course started in IIT KGP in 1959. This particular course has a history of its own. If we see the course curriculum of it, it's very structured and topics are mostly all related to the planning, obviously and also the topics are like housing and urban planning and history and principles of planning transportation engineering and planning so i have attached the link of the course curriculum of uh, mcp if you're interested in knowing all the subjects that are there and in which semester what they are teaching so i have attached the link in the description below where you can check the all the subjects okay uh, now the next thing is placement so as per my observation what i have seen is most of the students who do mcp they are mostly interested into government services also there are there are people who are who are more into transportation planning so they opt for transportation planning there are few students who are into the urban planning part of it so there are multiple opportunities that open for you so if you are someone who is interested into urban planning city planning and into also into the history of planning so all that things you will get it here and also this this particular course in IIT is also a great way to you know enter into PhD. So if you are interested into government services or you are into planning, urban planning, city planning or if you are thinking of doing PhD further. So for any of these options you can consider IIT Kharagpur MCP course. So the next course that we have is sustainable built environment that department of architecture is starting for the very first time in 2023 and the admission to this course is same through gate and the course curriculum that they are of revolves around sustainable architecture, sustainable built environment, their principles, sustainable urban architecture, sustainable materials. So all these topics related to sustainability are added there and I am so excited, you know, to know the reviews of this particular course because this is the first time and this is the first IIT that has started sustainable architecture related any course and I'm so excited for this and I think if you are someone who who is you know sustainability enthusiast or who whose inclination is towards sustainable architecture you should consider it without thinking of you know uh, without thinking of uh, oh they are starting for the first time I don't know how will be the procedure and all that you know trust trust the institute trust the department because it it's way too old and they have everything in a very structured way so if they have started it so i believe it will be good so trust your intuition and if you are getting a chance to you know enter into this course and your inclination is towards sustainability then you can think of uh, you know joining this course so since it's starting for the first time so we can't say much about the placement and everything but uh, it will be good i believe 
ओके सो द नेक्स्ट एंड द लास्ट कोर्स दैट आई आई टी खड़गपुर ऑफर्स इज एम टेक इन इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर डिजाइन एंड मैनेजमेंट सो आई डिड दिस कोर्स एंड एडमिशन टू दिस कोर्स इज अगेन थ्रू गेट so so many people have asked this question about infrastructure design and management what actually there is in infrastructure design and management how the course curriculum is so today i'm going to answer all the questions finally uh, i'll answer this question based on my experiences and what we have studied there so in this particular course infrastructure design and management first of all i want to tell you here what was my reason of joining this particular course you know uh, after architecture i wanted to know more about you know what else i can do into it and what are other options into it i was more into the technological part and i i was exploring my interest at that time what i am more interested of so when i saw the course curriculum at that time and what i observed was uh, there were multiple different streams into it although everything was interrelated and before joining i thought it will give me different experiences and uh, knowledge in different sectors and that's what happened so you know the course curriculum of infrastructure design and management i'm not like bragging about the department or bragging about the course that i have done uh, you take your decision wisely based on what you actually want to do but don't confuse it with construction management or we are going to particularly into the construction management of building or housing course at iit kgp for infrastructure design and management it will talk about project management it will talk about the project finance and an environmental management gis is there and also facility management transportation plan so there are multiple things although there is no design that is in infrastructure design and management there is no design part that you will design like using autocad or anything nothing is nothing like that it's more of a mix of management and engineering also it gives you a holistic approach towards infrastructure so this course will give you idea basic idea on different things wherever you feel connected with wherever you feel you want to explore more into that particular subject that you can do that you can explore that you can dive deep into that particular subject to make your career into it if we talk about placement so placements are fairly good you know i have never seen anyone not even from infrastructure design and management i would say from from any of the branch from any of the iit be it city planning be it uh, urban planning be it anywhere i have never seen anyone who is without job if you won't get campus placement you will get off campus placement so the main benefit of doing your masters from iit or premier institutes is it will help you in getting that first job now the brand that you are associated with it will give you the platform from where you can fly high so if you think any of the point resonates with you if you are thinking to join into bachelors in iit or if you are thinking of joining any masters program in iit kharagpur and if any of the point that i have said you know if you can relate to it then you should consider this particular iit and you should go for it if you want to know more about any of the courses that i have discussed in this video you can leave a comment here or you can connect with me on instagram or also you can join our whatsapp group or telegram group i have added all the links in the description below so with this i wish you all the very best and if you need any help or guidance related to your career in architecture uh, whether you are thinking ki masters karna bhi hai ya nahi karna aur kyu karna hai yaar kya kare there was a time in my life also when i was stuck i didn't know where to go where not to go uh, i didn't know at that time why i am doing why there is need to do masters why should i do masters and what will be the benefit of it but now i have crossed all that i did masters so if you are clueless in your journey in architecture and you don't know where to move or uh, which direction to choose whether to go for job or masters or any other thing if you need any guidance or any help you can contact me i am there to help and I am doing this because I have been through this and I didn't have any guidance so so I want to help those who actually need help so if you need any guidance any help you can reach out to me anywhere okay thank you so much and keep learning keep growing